Welcome back. This is your boy HT3 bringing you God in travel. Now today's topic is Jesus and slavery. Jesus and slavery. Jesus is from God. Slavery, oppressive slavery is from Satan. Let me get that out of the way real quick. I hate I hate when people try to, to use slavery and put it on the Christian religion. Christianity ain't had nothing to do with slavery. Christ said, love your neighbor. If you love your neighbor, you wouldn't turn them into a slave and oppress them. Let me say it again. Christ said, love your neighbor. And it's impossible to love your neighbor if you are oppressing them and enslaving them. So the work of slavery did not come from Christ or the Christian religion. Now to keep it real, when you hear African American Muslims they always say, well, I chose Islam because Christianity is a white man's religion. How can you listen to the religion of the slave masters? Let me get one thing straight. When the white man's slave master was bringing the slaves over, the first group was in 19, I mean 1619. Now, Christ died in about maybe 33 AD. So you're looking at about 1,500 years. 1,500 years between Jesus Christ and the white man slave master. 1,500 years. Uh, Christ had nothing to do with no white man slave master. When I speak to a lot of Muslims, black Muslims, they want to bring that up. But, but, Muhammad, their prophet, Muhammad owned slaves. Muhammad oppressed slaves. Not Jesus Christ, this is a Muslim thing. Because it is against the will of God for us to oppress anybody. Now that I got out of the way, and also you can't blame, you can't blame the works of men on Christ. You can't blame Christ on what Constantine did. You can't blame uh, Christ on what the Pope talking about. You may have a pastor that's sleeping with women within the congregation. You cannot blame Christ for that. So please stop trying to connect to Jesus Christ had absolutely nothing to do with slavery. As a matter of fact, to keep it real, African had slaves. They enslaved their own people too. The white men enslaved their own people too. And the Indians, the Indians, who y'all think were so holy and mighty, they enslaved themselves too and sacrificed themselves for the, the gods of their choice. So everybody had slaves. But it was not the work of Jesus Christ. See, Christ came down here to save the world. To teach the world about his Father's will. He did not come down here to inflict slavery on anyone. Slavery is man-made. It did not come from God. And yes, slavery is in the Bible. 
But God did not condone slavery. He did not. Once Adam and Eve bit their fruit in the Garden of Eden, they brought sin into this world. They brought lying into this world. They brought killing into this world. And yes, slavery came with it. By the way, much love to Africa. And also, uh, uh, Africa had Christianity long before the slave boat came. <laughs> Africa had scholars already in Christianity that can break the word down. In Africa, before the, the Europeans even touched it. Do your history. So stop blaming Jesus Christ for the works of Satan and the works of men. Put some respect on the Savior name, the anointed one name, the kings of kings, Lord of lords. Put some respect on Jesus Christ's name. Don't put that foolery on my Savior. And this has been God in Travel. Peace out. This is your boy, HT3.